Hey guys, uh, welcome to your um, energy check-in. This is going to be for uh, Virgo for the end of your September going into October. Uh, you can apply this to any of your replacements because this reading could be about anything. We're just going to see what the cards have to say. Uh, we're going to take a look at your over energies, okay? What's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for the end of the month. And then we will see what the possible outcome advice are, what else you guys need to know. So um, apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what take what rest needs and leave the rest behind if this message didn't resonate with you take a look at your other placements if you guys haven't done so yet hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post give this video a thumbs up like this video share this video leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective virgo people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular uh, if you're looking for a reading specific to your unique situations and your energies um uh, you could book, uh, book a private personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below okay so Virgo, let's get started. Tell me about Virgo here. Over energies for Virgo. What is surrounding Virgo? What does Virgo need to know for the end of the September going into October? What do we have for Virgo here? What do we have for Virgo? What do we have for Virgo? All right, you got Temperance and a Star. Wow. So, Virgo, it seems like you're healing here. Okay. Seems like you're being guided by the universe, the divine, your guides, your ancestors here. Seems like you're finding some sort of peace, some sort of hope here, okay? Um, so Virgo, I feel like you've been through a lot, okay? And I feel like things are starting to clear out here. Yeah, you're starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel. You know, I feel like, you know, there is an excitement here about planning a future here, okay? There is an the energy of like starting all over again, okay? So I feel like, you know, with the Page of Swords, I feel like you're learning a lot about yourself right now, okay? There is growth. There is evolution that's happening here. Page of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Four of Wands here and a King of Cups. Wow. Look at that. Happiness, stability here. Yeah, there's an energy of maturing here, okay? Um, and, you know, there's an energy of sort of like connecting emotionally, okay? Uh, perhaps, you know, uh, there could have been uh, a disconnect between your mind and your heart. Okay, and I feel like that's coming into alignment here for you, um, uh, Virgo. Okay, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Temperance. Okay, we have the Wheel of Fortune here. Things are changing in your favor. We have the Four of Cups here. Beautiful. Okay, you know, I feel like there is an opportunity here. There's a big opportunity here for you to improve. And I feel, I feel like you're taking it. I feel like you're being called by the universe to do this, Virgo. Okay, and the universe is supporting you on this opportunity that's coming towards you regarding your personal growth and your spiritual growth and your healing here. Okay, three of wands, three of cups, page of swords. We have the king of wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. There is excitement here regarding the future. Okay, uh, a lot of you guys could be reconnecting with like people that you've disconnected from. Okay, or people will be reaching out to you through text message. Pro Perhaps people that you haven't heard from in a very, 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 very long time. You know, you might be getting messages from people. Hey, you know, just thinking about you, you know, maybe we could get together and have coffee or something like that. I feel like, you know, towards the end of the month and going into October, you're going to be reconnecting with a lot of people here. You know, old friends, you know, family members that you haven't seen in a while. Uh, not really getting so much of like exes that are trying to reach out here, but, you know, more so people that you've lost touch with for quite a while that you could be wondering about or that they're wondering about you. Okay, King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sage, the Four of Wands here in the Strength card, the King of Cups and the Page of Pentacles here. Okay, um, you know, I feel like you're building a really strong foundation for yourself. And I feel like also with the Page of Pentacles, I feel like you're gaining the courage to like maybe put yourself out there more, okay? Um, there could be an offer that's coming in. There could be a message that coming that's coming in for you regarding an offer, of, uh, 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 regarding a job offer here, okay? You could be getting a job offer uh, that might... It, 
I, I'm getting this is maybe this job is regarding something in health insurance. That's what I'm getting here. Okay, um, but uh, you know, just take it as it resonates. But uh, whatever this new job offer that you're getting here, it's gonna it's gonna help you create that stability and happiness that you're looking for. That security. Okay. Um, let's see what else we have here. What else do we have here for uh, Virgo? Outcome of advice here for Virgo for the uh, second half, not second half, for the end of your September going into October. What else do we have here for Virgo? Outcome and advice. What else does Virgo need to know? Okay, we have the Magician here, Gemini Virgo, and the Hermit Virgo. There you are. Showing up in your read. We have the Ten of Wands here and the Page of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sag, and the Sun, and the Emperor. Wowzers. Look at that. Look at the growth and evolution here. Going from like a page to a king and then an emperor. Okay. So, oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, Magician and the Hermit. Ten of Wands and the uh, Ten of Wands and the Page of Wands. You know, you could be releasing a lot of. You could be shedding a lot of layers here. You could be purifying a lot of. You know, um, trauma, burdens. You know, pain that you've been carrying around with you. A lot of that's being released here. Okay, so like I said, you know, I feel like you're being called to do this, or that this process has been ongoing for a very, very, very long time. Okay, I mean, look at this happiness. Okay, structure here. Okay, uh, you know, sort of like owning your space, you know, sort of like, you know, being proud of what you have achieved through your process here, Virgo. Okay, we have the Sun Leo energy and the Emperor Aries energy. All right, tell me about the magician here. Why is this magician here? We have the Seven of Swords, the Hermit, and the Ace of Swords here. Yeah, I feel like you're clear about what you want. Okay, it seems like you're having a major breakthrough here. You know, this is you know, you, this is an energy where you're no longer lo you're lo no longer self sabotaging yourself anymore. You know, these narratives that you've had. You know, these you know, these um, experiences that you've been through. I feel like you're no longer allowing them to control you. Okay, so there's a lot of releasing that's ha happening here. Okay, uh, there's a lot of realizations, breakthroughs here. Ten of Wands, we have the Eight of Pentacles. We have the Page of Wands here and the Knight of Pentacles. You know, it might have taken you taking you some time to let this all go, but it's it's it, it's moving. The energy is basically moving. The energy is basically transmuting here. Okay, with the Knight of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles, this would be, it could, it could be indication. Yes, you might be getting a lot of uh, like a new job offer, and you're going to be working a whole lot here. And I I'm feeling like you're excited about this, uh, Virgo. Okay, uh, because I feel like this is. You know, I, I'm getting for some of you guys, Virgo, some of you guys might have been out of a job for a very, very long time. So I feel like this is something that's really exciting uh, to you that you're finding here. Okay. Uh, Knight of Pentacles, uh, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. We have the Sun here, Three of Swords, and then we have the Emperor here and the Seven of Wands. Okay. You know, I feel like, you know, you are still healing from hurt, pain, heartbreak here. But, you know, with the Seven of Wands, there's definitely an energy of overcoming. Like I said, uh, it seems like you're going through like a gradual evolution that... Uh, and this process has been going on for a while. I mean, we're going from pages to knights to kings and then the emperor here. You know, this is, you know, this is basically transcending. Yeah, this is basically transcending and leveling up. Okay, Virgo. So this looks really, really, really good. So Virgo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Uh, share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe. Uh, Hit the notification bell and I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.